today I will be doing a unboxing on Astrogram. Oh yeah. Um this is my first video, this is my first starting to my channel. Um this is basically gonna be vintage collecting and yeah. Uh you'll mainly be seeing Action Man, G.I. Joe, and a lot of more vintage items. Today we'll be looking at an action man that came in the mail. I do not know what it is. Um, but I do know that we got a, a diaper man right here that has not been opened yet. Um, that we're going to open in the next video. But first I want to go to small to big. And basically, yeah, we're just going to start off with my channel. And sooner or later. Yeah. Oh yeah, my name is Frankie. Uh, for Frank, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I guess so. I'm gonna start cutting it. I'm just gonna just keep it like this. I can just skip all the rest of it. Yeah, there's a lot. There it is. Um,. Um, I started my G.I. Joe collecting, and Action Man collecting, when I was looking through my, um, my dad's old, in my dad's storage unit area, and it turns out my family had their stuff there too. I found a, um, G.I. Joe Adventure Team House, a Pally Toy Action Man. Okay, So yeah, I got my, I got a, um, uncompleted Sea Wolf from the Action Man era, I mean, not the Action Man era, the, um, the Adventure Team era, a headquarters, not fully completed either, just two headquarters, one of them was so messed up, which is going to need restoring, which we'll see in another video, and one is half complete and ha nice and good condition, I feel like. And then we got the seal from the car, which I'd like to see close. And I got um, the mummy car and plus the mummy. So we'll be taking a look at those two. So I got a lot of the good stuff that I started. Um, yeah, that's what started me off. And I got a book. I read more about it. And this is where I am right now. So this is going to be the beginning of my G.I. Joe collection. And yeah, I'll just see how much. We'll see how we do. And see what we get, and then look at the value. And yeah, I just gotta hard to pass. Oh, I actually have heard this before. I'm not so in the history of the army, but I'm pretty sure by the badge. Like, I'm kind of. Um, I can see by the badge that's the last issue. So, I think that's cool. So I've heard, I have heard of the Eagle Eyes and the Comfy Grip, which I currently have right here. Plus a rifle and a grenade. I've seen how they were these when I saw the video from Analog Toys. Let me see. I will be trying to restore this. The hands are a little bit dirty, which I want to clean. I haven't checked anything. There's a little bit of tears, a little loose string, and a little bit of loose, um... What do we call it? Um, no. Nice rifle. Uh, of course, tears. I think this is from the Pally Toy Action Man era. So, that is pretty cool. So, I just have to use eyes. I want to take a a little cut there. Yeah, a little bit of using salt. If anything, it's really in great condition. I think that's really cool. Yeah, it took me a minute. Mm, but for anything else, that is uh, very cool. 
Oh yeah, I got a couple of figures um from my uncle's just about one of the time. There's one of five. I don't know if it works. This is the um I apparently it was an Adventure Team figure. But it had a little bit of action there, plus the muscle had a little turtle neck, the pants, and then I got the beret off of those four peacemakers, printed, and then the rifle in here, and I think it's broken, I'm not sure if it's broken, painted, and I think this is from the Hall of Fame, the G.I. Joe version, cuff hands, not a punchy kick, but yeah, this is one, and I got a whole bunch more over there in the studio, which I call my studio because it's a very big room, that's where I have all my stuff, and I do most of my recording. So, walk here, and yeah. I will be um, putting these on display once they feel like they're ready to. And that is pretty much it for this video. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, like I said, this is my first video, so... I mean a lot. Uh, I think I had a first turn a long time ago, but I didn't really do much. I did this, like, one vintage Spider-Man. That's pretty much it. Um, but, uh, yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, and have a great day. Bye.